Yo, what's going on guys, Hennis here. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make a color changing overlay for your live stream. I get asked this question every now and then on my live streams and it's pretty easy to do, so I figured I'd make a tutorial on how to do it. So the first thing to do is make a variant for each of the colors or styles that you want to be a part of your color changing overlay. To do this, I'm gonna go ahead and open up Photoshop and create a brand new project. And this will work with any photo editor or creator, it doesn't have to be Photoshop. So for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm gonna make a color changing overlay that just switches between red and orange. So the first thing I'm gonna do is make a face cam box here on my new Photoshop project. And I'm gonna make this overlay red by changing the color overlay to red, just like that. Now, in order for this to work as an overlay, your background does need to be transparent. So make sure you get rid of the background. I do that using the magic eraser tool. Once you've got a transparent checkered background and you've got your first color or style for your overlay that you want, you can go ahead and save this as a PNG. I'm gonna save it on my desktop in a brand new folder called new folder. Again, save it as a PNG and I'm gonna call it red. And now that that's saved, I can make the orange style of my overlay. So I'm just gonna go up and change my face cam color overlay, this time to orange. And again, once I've got the color that I want, I'm gonna save it as a PNG. And again, for the purposes of this video, I'm just making my overlay change from red to orange. But in theory, you could do this for an infinite amount of colors or styles. If you wanted to be super tedious and make hundreds of color styles, that is up to you. You can do as many or as few as you want. So now that we've got both the color styles we want, I'm gonna close Photoshop and open up OBS. Now in OBS under sources, I'm gonna right click, go to add and click image slideshow. You can call this whatever you want. I'm gonna call it face cam overlay. And within your image slideshow properties window, you're going to add all the colors or styles you just made. Now you could just add the directory and choose the folder where you saved all your colors or styles. But the problem is sometimes they won't fade in the correct order. So for example, if you're going for a smooth color transition, like what I'm going for, you don't want your images to accidentally be out of order and have it fade from red to yellow and then to orange. You'd want a more smooth transition and have it go from red to orange, then to yellow. And you could still do this by adding a directory, but you would have to make sure that all the files in the folder where you have your colors or styles saved are named in the order that you want them to change into. So for example, if I wanted red to come before orange, I would have to change the name of this red file to one red and change orange to two orange because the image slideshow in OBS is going to display your colors or styles in the order that they're named alphabetically in the folder. Whenever I've done this in the past, I've always added the files individually. It's a little bit tedious, but it allows you to have more control. So again, I'm going to click add files, navigate to my folder, and choose my first color, for me it's red, and then choose my second color, and for me that's orange. Now in these two text fields here, you can choose how long each color or style stays on screen for and how long it takes to transition from one color or style to another. So just so you guys can see how this works, I'm gonna have each color stay on screen for 3000 milliseconds or three seconds. And I'm gonna have the transition speed be 500 milliseconds or half a second. And then I'll click okay. Now, unfortunately, I don't have a camera attached to this computer so I can't complete the scene for you, but hopefully this gives you a good idea of what it's gonna look like. Image slideshows are a great way to have seemingly animated or color changing overlays without having to pay someone to actually make them for you. So there you go. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to Pro Tutorials if you're new. That's gonna do it for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.